Heaven Paralegio gets a date for the star Magic Ball. Former Pinoy Big Brother housemate Heaven Paralegio was flattered when Filipino British fashion model and football player Mark Paul Robert Patterson, better known as Marcus, asked her to be his date to the star Magic Ball. In a photo posted by Heaven on Instagram, she received a bouquet of roses and Marcus knelt before her with a panda bear stuffed toy. You're full of surprises. It's a date then, ha ha. See you at the ball, she wrote. Thank you for watching this video inviting you to watch the next video. Chris Berno gets affected by first villain role. Sometimes you feel bad about me. Impostora lead actress Chris Berno admits it is hard to portray a dual role in a leisurely. In her GMA 7 afternoon show, she plays the main character Nympha who underwent plastic surgery to be the imposter of the evil Rosette. Due to the good feedback and high ratings that their show has been receiving, Chris feels that she is now reaping the fruits of her labor. Management has even extended the Kapusa daytime series until January 2018. She says with a smile, I'm happy that at least, I was able to stand or do, because my goal really is, they see two different people really in one face, e. It's a difficult thing to do to differentiate their behavior. I mean, you can take on makeup but they still have mannerisms, the way they talk, and I really studied her. Just like the feeling that after all your difficulties, you'll get good feedback, you'll get good ratings. Well, I'm very tired, but it's okay, just a game. Playing a contributor role for the first time, Chris feels there were moments when she becomes reset even in real life. She continues, just because sometimes, when I was too tired, I was once carrying my reset, e. I'm not stuck plastic, but sometimes, I'm getting my reset because of course, it's as if you're in character because you're in a hurry, e. So sometimes, you feel that I have a bad habit, so you're so irritable for people. But then, people just need to be patient with me. And I also need to control my emotions, because I'm out of the box. The starstruck, the next level female winner thinks that she is effective as the evil reset because she is playing a role that is not close to home. She explains, I mean, Nympha Kasi is me reset because it is not you but you have to portray it so you really carry her especially when you're in a scene or you need to concentrate on a feeling, that's why irritating feeling, you have to concentrate on that. So of course, everyone who comes to me, my makeup artist, seems like I'm feeling anxious. Chris is especially happy that many people still watch the show even though it is a remake. At least, the man is biting the story that really has the same face as the face, the same face as face. In fairness, click on people who see double. Impostora is the 2017 TV adaptation of the comic serial In a Corner of Dreams, which was turned into a movie in 1994 starring Alice Dixon in the roles of Nympha and Rosette. In 2007, GMA7 made its own version with a slightly different storyline starring Asa Calzado and Sunshine Dixon. PEPPH, Philippine Entertainment Portal and other reporters recently spoke to Chris during a visit to the set of Impostoria at the Urology Center of the Philippines in Quezon City. When Chris faced the press during the set visit, she was on nympha mode. Hurting herself. Another challenge that Chris had to face was shooting confrontation scenes by herself. It became even more difficult for her since this is the first time that she portrayed a villain role. Because I've never experienced that, right now so it's just a new challenge for me so new attack. So what's the feeling of the villains, but I'm still in the mood for it. But it's more fun than he is, e, you can play the crazy girl. In one instance, Chris had to release all of her emotions while talking only to a long stick. There was even a time when she had to act in a scene with nothing at all. Here is one of her Instagram stories showing how she managed to pull off a scene without speaking to anyone. The 28-year-old actress discloses, it's really every time. I really need to imagine that I'm really talking to you and I have not received emotions in return. So, if he will spit on me then I need to cry, how can I feel it? So you really have to be self-interested, you have no problem, e. But I'm supported by the whole cast and the whole team. According to the Kapusa star, it takes almost two hours to shoot Nympha and Rosette's confrontation scenes. Every time with confrontation, it takes a couple of hours for a change, e. Aside from the camera angles, changing hair, makeup, outfit, 
memorizing the lines. Of course they also give me time to prep. But very fast but at least, of course, we have to be consistent with the different people they really see. In the GMA 7 afternoon show 6th commandment and haplos, they hired a fight instructor to guide the stars in their physical strenuous cat fights. However, Chris said that Impostor did not get a fight instructor for their cat fights. Instead, they hired a body double for the Capuso actress. Well, then, just a little bit, just can't fight, so I have a double body, so she does me all. But he really, when I became reset, he was really bad for me because I needed to know, e. If not, it will not be real emotions, so my body double is bad for me every time. Between Nympha and Reset, which character does Chris enjoy portraying more? I love Nympha because she is more kind, she is more beautiful than the value she shows. But I prefer Reset, because it's a good thing. She ended up with a laugh.